ever typed a question into the LLMs like chat GPT and got a really random answer? Like when you ask to debug a code and it just gives you a generic explanation that doesn't solve the problem? Yeah, that's not the AI, it's your prompt. Hi, I'm Ajit and this is Leaps to Learn where tricky topics turn into easy explanations. So why does AI fumble your questions sometimes? With AI, you won't get good answers if you don't ask clear questions. That's where prompt engineering comes in. Getting your prompts right is the secret to better AI responses. Today we are going to look at 4 ways to write good prompts. Zero sort, one sort, few sort and chain of thoughts. Let's start with zero sort prompting. This is the just do it method. No example, just instructions. If you ask the AI translate hello to Spanish, it will say hola. This works great but only for simple tasks like language translation or summarizations. Next, one shot prompting. Imagine you are teaching kids about emojis and you ask, if this emoji means happy and this one means sad, what does this mean? The hint helps them make the right guess. That's how one shot prompting works. Give the AI a clue and it catches on. Future prompting is similar, you offer a bunch of examples instead of just one. So if this emoji means happy, this means sad and this is crying, what about this? Now the AI has more patterns to work with. This will help it make more accurate responses. Now finally, there's chain of thoughts prompting. This is where you ask the AI to show its reasoning step by step. You are not just looking for the answers, you want the thinking behind it. If you ask the AI, if Sarah has 4 cookies and she eats 2, how many does she have left? Let's think step by step. Instead of just saying 2, the AI will say, Sarah starts with 4 cookies and she eats 2, so 4 minus 2 is 2, so the answer is 2. This is super helpful for maths, solving logical problems, or anything that requires careful thinking. So the bottom line, if the AI answer feels like it came from some other dimension, don't give up on it. Just give it a better prompt. Thank you for watching Leap to Learn. Let us know if you have got more topics for us to simplify. See you in the next leap.